Greetings and welcome to this brand new video. This video is an introduction to the newly released tool which is a tethered downgrade tool and it should work on all your supported devices which we will discuss in a bit without blobs and I am at the official GitHub page for Semaphorin and best of all it is completely free. After downgrading your iOS version, it will automatically also jailbreak it. And if you go into details, you can see it is available currently on Mac OS. Linux support is planned, but it is of low priority. So as you can see, all your A7, A8, A8X and A9 devices are supported by this tool. And if we go into details, you can see it looks like this. This is the GUI version of this tool. Yes, you can use the CLI version also. So as of beta 1, these devices were supported from iOS 7.0 through 8.0 beta 4. And now we have the new beta 2, which will support all your A8 and A9 devices also, as you can see them right here. But for A8 and A9, the minimum iOS version is 10.3.3 to 11.1. And you can see these devices here, which includes your iPhone 6, 6 Plus, 6S, 6S Plus, and your iPhone SE first generation along with these iPads. And yes, on A7, iPhone 5S and these iPads are supported. Now, as for the CLI version, if you want to use the CLI version, you can simply use this command to first of all clone Semaphorin and then use this command syntax to downgrade your device to the version of your choice. And of course, using the GUI version of Semaphorin would be a lot easier if you compare it to the CLI version of this tool. Also guys, as you can see it right here, side loading and App Store is working just fine on iOS 7 and App Store is working just fine on 10.3.3 to 11.1. .1. Now to get the app, you will simply head to the releases section and then scroll down to get the latest release from here under assets. If you check out the main page, you will see this compatibility chart. You can read it against the version you want to downgrade to. You can see what's working and what's not. And you can see this page outlines all the instructions which will help you to install the dependencies and then simply run the tool from your Mac OS currently. They have their official Discord server here also if you need help. You can see the first run here. So you will simply connect your device in DFU mode and then simply clone the semaphore and then run this command. So for example, sudo dot slash semaphorein.sh and the version you want to downgrade to, then hyphen hyphen restore. So the tool will ask you for the version which is currently installed on your device. You will simply enter it. And you can see after the downgrade process is complete, your device will be jailbroken automatically. And to boost your device every time, you will simply use this command sudo dot slash semaphorein.sh the version you have downgraded to previously and then hyphen hyphen boot. Talking about the requirements, macOS High Sierra to Catalina is currently supported, but they're trying to support the newer version of macOS also. So you will need Java 8 Python, which you can get from here easily and then install PYIMG4 using this command. Now, if you scroll down to the troubleshooting section, you can see that it outlines all the problems and the solutions so you can see what is working and what is not working and how you can fix it all the details are here and you can read it here that an intel mac is required amd cpus are not supported they will not work with this tool now at the time of making this video the current version is beta 2 you can simply pause the video here and read about the beta 2 change log. So Python was required in beta 1, but in beta 2, it is no longer required. 
long over the support for all your a8 to a9 devices as we have discussed earlier that's all for this video guys please give it a try and please comment below if it worked for you i will see you in a new video goodbye and take care of yourself